Moving on, China continues to clamp down on dissent in Hong Kong even after international pressure. The country is refusing to back down as of now. China's foreign minister Wang Yi has asserted that the rioting that occurred in Hong Kong is proof that its electoral system needs to undergo reform. He further said that the reform will help Hong Kong make the transition from chaos to governance. Hong Kong's transition from chaos to governance is fully in the interest of all parties and will also provide a more solid guarantee for safeguarding the rights of Hong Kong residents and the legitimate interests of foreign investors. We are determined to continue to adhere to one country, two systems, Hong Kong people ruling Hong Kong and a high degree of autonomy. We are also confident that Hong Kong will get better and better tomorrow. This comes after Beijing proposed a reform which, if enacted, will give Beijing the power to vet all election candidates in Hong Kong. Improving the election system of the Hong Kong Special Administrative Region and implementing Patriots ruling Hong Kong is not only a practical need to advance the cause of one country, two systems and maintain long-term stability in Hong Kong. It is also the power and responsibility of the National People's Congress conferred by the Constitution. It is completely constitutional and legal, justified and reasonable. The proposal has received scathing criticism from the West and within Hong Kong as well. It is being seen as an attack on the city's freedom. Critics say that the reform will put further pressure on pro-democracy activists who are already the subject of a crackdown on dissent. This comes a year after China imposed a national security law and detained many under the draconian law. Beyond World is One is now available in your country. Download the app now and get all the news updates on the move.